Hello everyone. The question here is sketch and describe the plant cell and the animal cell. Let us first describe the plant cell. In this image, you can see various components of plant cell like cell wall, cell membrane, nucleus, endoplasmic reticulum, ribosomes, Golgi body, chloroplast, mitochondria, and cytoplasm. Let's discuss all the cell components in detail. First is cell wall. Cell wall is the outermost covering of a cell. It is present only in the plant cell. Cell membrane or plasma membrane. It is thin covering. It is extremely delicate and flexible. Cytoplasm is the liquid part in the cell present around the nucleus. It occupies space between plasma membrane and the nucleus. Cell organelles are scattered in the cytoplasm. Nucleus is the most important organelle of cell. It is a porous double membrane structure. It controls all functions of the cell. Vacuole in plant cell is single and large and its function is to throw out waste from the cell. Next we have chloroplast. Chloroplast is only present in plant cell and it carry out the function of photosynthesis. Next we have mitochondria. Mitochondria produces energy and is also known as powerhouse of the cell. Next we have endoplasmic reticulum. It is a sprawling net like organelle. Its function is to make necessary changes in proteins produced by ribosomes and send them to the Golgi bodies. Let's see diagram of animal cell. In the diagram, you can see various components present in the animal cell that are nucleus, nuclear membrane, nucleolus, cell membrane or plasma membrane, endoplasmic reticulum, mitochondria, ribosomes, vacuole, Golgi bodies. In animal cell and plant cell, all the organelles are same except that in animal cell chloroplast and the cell wall are absent it is only present in plant cell vacuoles in animal cell are more in number and small in size whereas in plant cell vacuole was single and large i hope i'm clear with this question thank you